guys welcome back to my channel and for those of you that are new i'm glad to have you here today so today i went to target staller spot otherwise known as their bullseyes playground and oh my gosh guys i just did my first back to school shopping haul as a teacher and i am so super excited so in today's video let me go ahead and show you everything i got for back to school from target all right, let's begin. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with the bigger items. And this first item is a dry erase activity blotter. I know the name doesn't really quite go with what this is. For me, these are different types of graphic organizers put onto this big chart here. And this is done so that you can use a dry erase marker on there and wipe it off. I haven't used it before, so I don't know how good it will be, but hopefully it works really well. And if so, this will be so amazing in my classroom. I love it. Let me go ahead and turn this over because this has eight pages. Or if you count them back in front, total of 16 pages. And let me show you in the back what it looks like. I went ahead and turned it to the back. And here you can see all of the dry erase activity blotters included. It says multifunctional charts to aid in large group discussions or small group learning. And I just call them graphic organizers, but that's okay. Call them whatever you want. This is $7 and the DPCI is 234241661. I got a second dry erase activity blotter and this one has math on there so i thought it was amazing like you can see the first one here has decimals and numbers that you can write in standard form word form expanded form this is amazing and let me go ahead and show you the back so you can see what others are included turning to the back you can see all of the different dry erase activity blotters and You've got the fraction one and all the others, which is awesome. Again, this costs $7 and I believe it has the same DPCI, which is 234-241661. Next items I got are these book boxes. And although these look like the ones that were the large book boxes last year, they're similar, but they're different because they're actually a bit thinner or more narrow. And so let me go ahead and show you what it says here. This is one count book box with two removable dividers and the dividers are adjustable. Basically, you can see that you could insert the dividers, you can insert one, two, or none at all. These book boxes are $3 each and the DPCI is 234-248383 and they all share the same DPCI. So if you wanna see how this works, looking in here, you can see the box is pretty much open. You can see it on both right there. But if you look in there, you'll see that there are tabs on the bottom. You can leave the book boxes like this without any tabs, or you can just go ahead and insert one or maybe two, depending on what you want, and then it works that way. And if you're like me and you think to yourself, there are no dividers, where do I get the dividers? Because you look around like this, like this. Guys, they're hiding in the back. You see this right here, this little plastic bag with the little things in there? Those are the dividers. I honestly thought none of these had dividers. I was like, wait a minute, where do I find them? I'm not gonna buy them without it. And then I saw this and it dawned on me, these are the dividers that are included. So you can see the dividers are not tall, but then that's because these book boxes aren't very tall either in the front. So I think they're as tall as the front right there, maybe a little shorter, but they are gorgeous. I love them. And as you can see, I got these colors here. So I got them in pink, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, and I believe there was black and possibly a red. I can't guarantee, I don't know 100% for sure, but I believe there were those size or those colors as well. And again, here's a look at the sides going up. So they are really nice and useful. And I'm thinking perhaps I might wanna get another set because if you've seen my classroom library um, videos, then you'll know that I definitely have the space for them if I move things around and I kinda wanna get these. I think these would be really good for my 
nonfiction books just because they're thin and you know I can like section them off like that I mean this would be actually perfect well we'll see we'll see when I go back to class and I know some of you like it when I stack the whole thing in rainbow order so here is the stack of book bins I mean I know I love it too and right here we have our side view for those of you wanting to see the side view and then the back view as well and don't mind all of those wrinkles that's just the clear plastic bag holding the dividers in there so there you go gorgeous the stack. next item did not come from target's dollar spot it's actually from universal thread but you know what this year going back to school i need to be able to use a face mask and although i have one that is a bit better than this i am bringing this to my classroom and i am storing it there just in case you never know like i might forget one day mine might break somebody might not have one and need one and if that's the case i want to make sure that i have an extra or two in school in my classroom so i went ahead and bought this and this actually is a two pack so you can see the first one's really cute it has kind of this plaid print done in neutrals which i love whites and grays and the other side's just a solid gray. And it does have a filter pocket, flexible nose piece, machine washable, and this is $4. And the DPCI is 061-047256. So yeah, this is a different type of school year, but you know what, I'd rather be safe than sorry. For the new year with the new kiddos, I of course need nameplates. And so I went ahead and bought these. By the way, the nameplates come in 30 count sets. So the first set I bought has the alphabets done in uppercase and lowercase. It has numbers on two different hands from one to 10. And it shows you left hand versus right hand. And also there are different shapes plus there's room to write the student's name so i really like that in the beginning of the year because a lot of kids come in and they don't know how to write the letters perfectly sometimes so it'll be there for them to see sometimes it's hard for them to add or subtract so they'll have the numbers on the fingers right there and you'd be surprised a lot of students don't know their shape so it's good to have that there as well and so i'm happy about that now the other nameplate i got i figure i can use towards the second half of the year when the kids already know you know the basic one to ten they already know how to write their alphabets uppercase and lowercase and this is where we start really pulling in the math a lot more using number lines number charts and fractions and i was like this is so perfect because now they'll have their own little number chart at their desk right there so i was like that will be perfect moving along towards the second half of the year plus my students sometimes get theirs messy and so you know sometimes i like to you know fix it up for the second half of the year so this is perfect and of course to go along with that i've got the adhesive pockets because this is where i'm going to place their name plates and then this sticks to the desk so this is perfect and prices let's take a look at prices the name plates are only a dollar. Oh my gosh, they're only a dollar. That's such a good deal. I should buy extras. The DPCI is 234-244-4324. And for the plastic, it is $3. And the DPCI is 234-246443. So yeah, I think this is an amazing deal. This is something I get every single year and I didn't realize these were only a dollar. That's such an amazing deal, guys. Amazing. Definitely pick this up, you know? I mean, even if you don't get the adhesive pockets, you can always tape it down with clear packing tape or something, but you might as well get the um, pockets only thing in the pockets only come with 15 so if you need more than 15 definitely pick up two because during the middle of the year if you run out these are hard to find so 
Pick them up now while you can still find the them. The next items I picked up are the Bulletin Borders. And I absolutely love the borders from Target's Dollar Spot because they are sturdy enough, you know, they're thick enough, but they always come so cute looking. And these are the ones I chose. And I was really happy to find the rainbows because for some reason I've got a rainbow theme going in my classroom. I didn't start off that way, but I wanted it colorful. I picked up some rainbows and people started giving me rainbows and the rest is history. So each pack of borders comes in a 14 count and you can see I picked up the ones that look really nice and colorful. And guess what? On the back, it's done in white with black polka dots. So this is the same exact border, but this is the reverse side. So I love that you can mix and match them, or you can use one style on one board, another style on another board. You could layer them together. You could do whatever you want. And these are so cute. I love that there's always the option if I wanted to use a different print. And then I decided, you know what, I'm also going to pick up this alphabet one as well. And this one's done in black and white. And by the way, all these borders are only a dollar per pack. DPCI is 234-247999. And as mentioned, I picked up this black and white alphabet one, but look on the other side. Oh my gosh, how cute is this? The alphabets are done in a rainbow of colors. So I'm thinking of using this as a center where the students who don't recognize their alphabets yet can kind of mix and match them. Maybe use magnetic letters, regular letters, pictures, um, those clothespins with the alphabets. That's how I think I'm going to do it. But they're just so cute and good for letter recognition for the students who are still learning. So that's why I picked that up. And again, it comes with 14 of them. So how awesome is that? And for a dollar per set of borders, this is amazing. The next item I picked up are these wood clips. And these are just the cutest thing ever. So the wood clips are done in natural colors. But as you can see, there are a rainbow of letters on each of these wooden clips. So of course, there are 26 clips included. And it's only $3 for the set. DPCI is 234-243943. And then you can see the back is just plain like this. So the front is where it's super cute. So you're looking at this thinking these are cute, but what am I going to do with them, right? Well, here is the bulletin borders done with the alphabets. And you can see they kind of go with the letters. I mean, seriously. So I'm thinking I could use this for a center and just have the students recognize the letters and clip them together. That could be one thing. Or I could have pictures like maybe cat, dog, or something like that. So if I had a picture of a cat, they would take the C and clip it on, or if I said what vowel, or they could actually spell the words. I don't know. There's so many different things you can do. And so I grabbed it knowing that there is some kind of center that I can do using this. So I'm good with it. The next item is totally random, but oh my gosh, how fun is this? These are scratch off stickers. So basically if you have a sheet of paper or cardstock or whatever, you would write things on there and then you would cover them with these scratch off stickers and then have the person scratch them off and see what they can get. That would be so fun. Like maybe for prizes, you could do this with your students at school, maybe have Maybe their sight words on there, have them scratch it off. And if they scratch it off, have them figure out exactly how to pronounce the word, you know, something fun like that, that'll make learning seem like a game, you know what I'm saying? So I thought that this was so cool. And this includes 84 scratch off stickers. All right, let's see what it says. On the back, here you go. So it says pick your partner and then you can put names on them, scratch it off and get a partner. Or you could even do like groups. Oh my gosh, how fun would that be? Wow, okay, so that's so cool. By the way, this is a dollar 
per pack and the DPCI is 234-241214. Oh my gosh, I am so glad I picked this up. This is so cool. The next items up are name tags. And you're probably wondering how I'm gonna use this in class. Well, let me go ahead and tell you. So what I do is in the beginning of the school year, I actually provide the homework folders for my students. This is going to be their everyday folder where parents and I communicate with each other. It's where we, or where I send home notes or they can send notes to me. It's where I send home flyers. Everything important goes in these folders and it's to be used throughout the entire year. And so usually I create them and to make them easier for me to recognize right away and for them to know which is theirs is by putting on one of these stickers that say, hello, my name is, and I put their name on there. And oh my gosh, guys, it makes life so much easier being able to see whose folder it is just by looking at the front instead of having to open them up. Now these name tags, come with 24 sheets so you get 48 name tags oh man i didn't even have to buy two and this is the front and this is the back set so you get four different designs and guess what each pack is only a dollar for 48 name tags dpci is 234-241242 so in reality i did not need to buy two sets one set would have been enough because that would have covered 48 folders wow again what an amazing deal and how cute are these so super the cute. next items are the birthday items if you know me you know i love doing birthday goodie bags for my students and when i do i always include a birthday bookmark and a birthday certificate so this is so perfect i love that it matches so every year i just go ahead and buy it from target whatever they have is the one i buy and oh my gosh this is so super cute so first off are the reward certificates it comes with 30 of them and this one looks like a cupcake it says happy birthday and it has to and from so super cute i love it and it's perfect for boys or girls and then you also get the bookmarks that come in a 30 count as well and this matches but not exactly which i like because sometimes you know you don't want everything too matchy and so this one has a cupcake again but this time the wrapper's done in brown and it says have a happy birthday and there's sprinkles all over it how adorable are these oh my gosh i love cupcakes so this is so perfect okay let's go ahead and flip this over to the back and see what it says on the back of the reward certificates it's done plain but on the back of the bookmark it has the cupcake again and it says make today amazing and then you can write the name and the date right there just so super cute and guys these are only a dollar per set of 30 how amazing is that so for the certificate dpci is 234-241211 and the DPCI for the bookmark is 234-241200. The next items I found are treasure boxes and I am so super excited about this because they look exactly like treasure boxes. Now previously I think Target had these cardboard boxes that looked like different types of treasure boxes that you kind of had to bend and put together but i didn't get that and i'm so glad i didn't because these are already built to shape they are plastic so they'll last longer and so i can wipe them down and they are the cutest thing oh my gosh um previously i'd just been using plastic pencil boxes and it was only like last month or so that i decided i wanted to use an actual treasure box and I went with a cardboard one at first from Hobby Lobby. You might see that like a few videos back or so. And, you know, that's fine for bigger items. But, oh my gosh, this is perfect for students to use just because it's plastic. And I can wipe it down later. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Here's what it looks like opened up. And it's just basic in the middle. There's nothing, you know, crazy about it. It's just a nice basic pencil box. I mean, treasure box. The prize box costs $3 and the DPCI is 234-241662. So 
here's a look at everything I purchased today from Target's Dollar Spot, otherwise known as their Bullseye's Playground, and I am so excited by it. This is my very first back to school shopping haul as a teacher, and guys, this is one of the bright spots I've got this summer with everything going on, so I'm super excited by it. I am pleased that they put out rainbow borders. If you've seen some of my past classroom videos, you'll notice that I have some kind of rainbow theme going on. Um, the new bins are really exciting. I can't wait to try those out. And of course, I've got the nameplates and the birthday certificates and bookmarks. I mean, I know I need those for sure. You know, I always love making um, birthday goodie bags for my students. I'm excited by the treasure chest. Those are so super cute. And the plotters, I don't know why they call them plotters. That's such an odd name, but yeah, I'm excited by that too. I mean, it'll be exciting to try those out, see how that works. Scratch off stickers. And I know this is not from Target's Dollar Spot, but you know, it's an odd time. And you know, there's gonna be changes. And if it's something I need, then well, yes, I definitely need to bring that, right? So guys, this is it. This is everything I picked up from Target's Dollar Spot, otherwise known as our Bullseye's Playground for my first back to school haul as a teacher. And I love it. I hope that you guys enjoyed watching my video. I hope you like it. I hope you share it with your friends. And if you haven't done so already, I hope you subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day, guys.